Hey everybody, I uh, made this video, or I'm making this video to show you what you can expect from a good L3 filmless system. Uh, these are RNVGs that we're going to be looking through, and the tube I'm going to hold the camera in front of is a 37 SNR, 72 line pair resolution tube. Uh, it has a gain of around 63,000, and the EBI is 0 0.5 with a halo of 0 0.7. Right now we have, I believe it's 0 0.07 or it, it's less than 1% moon. We're in a Bortle 3 area. Uh, you can Google that. It's kind of an astronomy term. Uh, basically we're very rural, uh, but not quite observatory in Arizona quality yet. So it's also 100% cloud cover. You can see there's absolutely no stars. You can hear the rain in the background. And this is what you can expect from a quality L3 filmless system in these conditions. See, we're able to see easily into open spaces. See my porch and garage. Kind of walking slow here because I'm looking through my phone. I literally can't see the hand in front of my face. see under the shadows of those trees out in the open. You can see the feeder hanging inside the chicken coop there. And it looks better in person. Um, things usually don't look that great through a camera with nods. Holy depth perception Batman. This is difficult. <laughs> Some tree cover there. We can easily see into it, under it. Some tree cover here. See under that, see into there. into the chicken coop. You can see two chickens roosting dead center zone one on that branch. Water bowl or basin rather. You can see under the solar array. Long story short, even in extremely challenging conditions, um, L3 Filmless will generate a very useful image. That's not to say you don't want some illumination, but it's pretty good. Let's see if we can get the dog to come out. Here, boy. Come here. Come on. So you can see him get up. Walk out of the chicken coop. Come on, boy. Here, boy. Good boy. He's happy. He's wagging his tail. He's looking for us. Even he probably can't see very well at all in this kind of lighting. This is... Uh, as close to a superpower as I've gotten so far. <laughs> anyway, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you see the value of some high-spec tubes when it gets really dim out.